Good morning, everybody. Hola. <laughs> okay, today, what are we doing? We are in Lake Havasu. We are on our way back to uh, Quartzsite of the RTR. And the halfway ending of the Parte R. Some people wanted to know what the RTR stood for. Rubber Tramp Rendezvous. And if you want to find out more information about that, you could go to Bob Wells. Um, what is his channel name? Cheap RV Living. Cheap RV Living. Anyways, before we head out and get on the highway, we are going to stop down here in Havasu City. And we're going to go to what is called the Buses Under the Bridge. It is <laughs> a whole lot of Volkswagens. Volkswagens! Yep. Scotty and I love Volkswagens. Uh, we used to own a few Volkswagens. What have you owned? Got too many. <laughs> my favorite one was, what was the year that the Stinger was on? Oh, my 66. 66. 66. Yeah. I drove that for a very long time. Scotty had a big long Stinger on it. That's what we call it. And uh, I love that little buggy man. Because I put a sweet, sweet motor in that puppy. <laughs> what do you have in it? Uh, there was a 1641 uh, with a heck of a great cam, Weber carved. It was, I could get that close to lifting those front wheels off the tire, put off road clutch system <laughs> on it. It was a racing buggy for a small little engine. And Scotty used to work on Volkswagen, so he knows his stuff. Anyways, so we're going to go there. I know a few of you guys um, have joined us or joined Scotty at uh, uh, Volkswagen um, car shows before. You guys all seem to like them, so I hope you guys enjoy this one. We don't know how, what's there, um, but we're gonna go. And this is an annual event. Uh, <clears throat> I don't know if they always run it on the same weekend. It's five dollars to get in for the for the whole weekend. You can use yeah. the pass for the whole weekend, and there are some prices uh, for camping down there. And we'll show you that when we get there. There's a, a board, I believe, out there because we did drive by, but we didn't go in yesterday. So we'll show you that, and that's it. And I think it's buses, um, yeah. which are really cool. Some of the old buses, new buses, I'm not all that into and everything. In fact, yeah. I think uh, it was last year. I, I they had a little bug uh, meet up in one of the Ooh, states sorry, were in Georgia or something, and I did not realize they were still making those things, but in a different country and, and even the old trucks. I love the trucks, the bugs, and I do love the older buses. And they've got West Follies down there. So if you're into West Follies, I believe there's some of those down there. Anyways, all right, we'll see you guys at the uh, V-Dub show. Okay, I haven't even made it inside yet. And out here is a 67 SS Camaro. I love Camaros. Oh, yeah, it's beautiful. Absolutely. And he's got the the knockouts or whatever you call them there. Oh. And the hideaway grill. Absolutely beautiful car. I've had several Camaros. That is really sweet. Okay, let's go look at some buggies. Oh, and then uh, another thing that I forgot to mention, or Terry did, is next weekend is the Camaro Fest here. Yeah, we might end up uh, coming back. Yeah. That's uh, another one of our favorites. Owned a couple. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah, exactly. Lots of Volkswagens, lots of Camaros. I oh, love several when Camaros. We go to these shows, and then you guys tell us uh, all the different cars you guys have had, too. It's so fun. And we've actually had people send us pictures of their rigs, and oh my gosh, it's fun to look at those. Yeah, absolutely. Okay, let's pay our money and go check it out.
Hey, this is a 66 21 window and uh my 66 Volkswagen that Terry was talking about before was exactly this same color. And uh, we had a 23 window. It was a 63, I believe is what it was. And it, so it had corner windows on it here. Um, and had the rooftop like that. Lots of fun. Lots of fun. As a kid, you just played with them as little <laughs> I don't know. We just drove it all over the place. Sure wish I would have kept it. Mine had the bars like this all through all those windows. And if I remember right, but I did not have the front windows that opened, but I, this, this has been, oh, almost 40 years ago. So <laughs> I forget, yeah, I know. It's nice to see people uh, still love their buggy. So they've got this one where it's kind of like, you know, the eyeballs. Mm. Then we've got the, over here, the Volkswagen covers. Yeah. Kind of different <laughs> little things on their windows. And it's funny to see a 1960 Volkswagen with solar panels on it. <laughs> <laughs> Lots going on. Well, I bet it's a party down here at night. Oh, yeah. Boy, look at that. No windows on that one there. I have no clue what year it is, but that is sleek looking. That is about as custom as you can get on spinning on a rig. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. I'm going to be shooting you guys into the sun, but. Yeah. I think what, what is cool now is old, the old look. <laughs> Look at this thing. Look at this. Very cool. Janice Joplin, I'm assuming. All right, this has got to be my favorite right here. I love their tent. It's got lots of color on it. And then look at this. This is my absolute favorite. I mean, so true to the Volkswagen with peace. <laughs> They've got the sombrero up there. And she's just got a nice little area all parked out here, set up. Look at her little hangers right here, too. Cute. Our friends who were there were like, well, let's go into town. She's got little hangers in here. She's done a beautiful job fixing it up in there. Wow. Fun. So they've got like a little swap meet going that they can uh, sell stuff out here, I guess. That's kind of fun. I will tell you, the smell of ganja is very rich out here. <laughs> and maybe I'm just more sensitive to it because I don't do that, so <laughs> you can definitely smell it. Oh, look at that guy. Oh, sweet boat. Boy, these are prime spots right here, right on the uh, water. This bluish green, that's my favorite color. I love that. 
Do what, babe? The water's really down in the lake. And this guy's fishing in the... I was telling him that the smell of gunja is a little strong There's, here. I, I've noticed, yeah, I was going to say that <laughs> it smells like a lot of weed. Yeah. Maybe we're close to California. Well, Maybe it's coming from the other side. <laughs> mm -hmm. Well, it probably is a lot more potent to me, maybe. <laughs> I don't know. It has the smell of bacon and ganja. <laughs> and Fritos. Yeah. Now, there's your 23 window. And now I do remember, if I'm correct, it's like I said, it's been years. Mine did have the bars just in these two back windows because I know it didn't have it on the door that opened up over there. Again, I had the, the same roof like that. Ooh, custom dash. Oh, maybe. I don't know. Pretty cool. Pretty, pretty sweet. I didn't have a dash like that. That's absolutely beautiful. Absolutely beautiful. Let's see here. How true is this? Maurice, we'll see you. Alright, we'll see you guys. Uh, I'm gonna share camera. Wow, that's really beautiful. Cool. I call it his and hers. I'll take the truck, you take that one. Let's sell the house and we can buy those. <laughs> it's a deal. We've done crazier things in our life. Yeah.